So Poppies was written on, well, I say it was written, the idea, because when I write songs, the, it's normally just mucking around on the guitar for normally just pl play anything, play like a cover or play um, just a, a chord progression. And you just somehow that you just take takes you into a place once you once you've played for a while where you feel really creative. It tends to be on a hangover normally. It's a weird one where you can really let your soul out when you're you're singing. I guess it's kind of my form of meditation, my form of um, I don't want to say escapism because you know escapism is a really bad thing. Well, not a bad thing, but it just kind of sounds negative, doesn't it? It's like, what are you escaping from? I'm not escaping for anything, but it's it's connecting with the truth. You're talking, you know, you're... When I say truth, I don't mean, like, lying and telling the truth. I mean what is um, common between all of us, that truth. So that's how I see it, anyway. Now, um, it was just Sunday. It was a Sunday afternoon. Was it Sunday? I can't remember. It was, but it was the 11th of November, which in the UK is Remembrance, Remembrance Day um, to mark the end of the, the, the First World War in 1918 in Europe. So it's uh, this, this kind of song idea just came to it, and it wasn't like a, a lyrical thing or anything like that. I, when I get songs, it's more about the 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 melody the vocal melody so I was just playing some chords and then just kind of came up with this like and the it's one of those which you know as a song it kind of just fell out of the sky quite quickly um, and I could just kind of put the the lyrical melody on it on the chords quite quickly because when you've got a good chord progression I find if you've got um, a nice little chord progression then the and I don't just mean the chord progression I mean like the rhythm as well how you're playing it if that sits quite nicely it's, 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 it's so much easier to put the lyrical melody on top uh, I guess it stands to reason really um, so that came the lyrical melody came so I recorded it um, onto my phone as I do any idea that I get so it just went on my phone, and I've still got it, and it's marked 11th November, it's quite cool. It was only a few days later when I was supposed to go in the studio to record another song that, I don't know, I just thought, I, get, I, I, I recorded a rush, I wrote some lyrics down, and I quickly, um, I didn't really even know the lyrics, but I, I, like, off by heart, and I always think that's a better thing to do, but I then... Went to the studio the next day, I was like, look, I've got two songs. I've got this song, which I just kind of literally have come up in the last few days, and I've got this other song, which I've been working on for months. And um, immediately, the guy Oliver, who I, I um, work with at the moment, or one of the guys I work with, his um, producer, he, he was like, oh, you know, I've just been working on quite a few slow songs recently. It'd be quite cool if we could uh, do something a bit more upbeat. And this was much more upbeat it was a very you know it's very upbeat song although the lyrics were all about war um the 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 actual song is is quite upbeat um so yeah i was just like okay well look if you're happy then let's do that because i'm i'm you know either way i'm happy just do one of those songs so we started working on on that one and yeah it just like i had a really good feel about it um, the and the lyric, I mean the and the lyrics didn't really change. I, I think I re-recorded the vocals kind of a few um, like a month or so later because I just I don't know I fancied it seemed like I knew the song a bit better then, so I felt a bit more confident doing it. And that's what's come about from the uh, yeah from the recording. So it's kind of like the making of the the actual music. Took ages to get it mastered. Eventually, just found a guy. Some guy, um, a guy, uh, messaged me off Instagram actually, and I was supposed to be doing this, um, getting it mastered with another guy. Um, and that didn't work out. So I was just like, well, you know, mate, if you can 
do this, let's give it a go. And uh, within a week, he mastered it and I really liked it. It's just like, wow, power of Instagram. Wee, the internet. I also do think that is true. Like, if there's just so much out there, I mean, Instagram, you know, or any social media is a powerful tool and you can waste a lot of time on it, but also, it, you know, it also does open doors if you um, put the effort in and uh, open-minded. Anyway, I'd like to also talk about the kind of like meaning behind the lyrics. That's probably a bit more in depth, a bit more metaphysical, but that was just the story behind how the song came about.